Adelaide City Council provides funding across all of the year under our Community Development Grants program. So, you know, it can be very small grassroots events or projects to large scale multi-year projects. Our priorities are around community building, neighbourhood development, social inclusion and basically connecting uh, people within the city and building a better city life. NAIDOC South Australia for several years have been financially supported through the Adelaide City Council's major community development grant. I think this gives us an opportunity to celebrate, to come together in a positive way, in a family environment. We have a men's zone, a women's zone, a children's zone, active zone, and the stall holders. So it brings together a whole lot of activities uh, that anybody can participate in. So it's about connecting with the broader community as well, and for that broader community to know that they can come here and be welcome to come and participate and celebrate with us. I love sock knitting. I love knitting full stop, but sock knitting in particular. And through the workshops, we're hoping to get people to come and learn and see how easy it is to actually knit a pair of socks. One of the other ladies in the group suggested that we applied for a community development quick response grant from Adelaide Council. As we get to relate to different people of different cultural backgrounds, it helps break down the barriers that can exist between the cultures. This sort of thing is very, very important as an informal way of people learning about each other and learning about other people. In a nutshell, Rec Legs about providing opportunities for people. Our vision is rebuilding lives through recreation, sport and arts. It's grassroots community development. It's getting people together around a table, around a barbie, kicking a footy. So the social part of what we do is really, really crucial. The last three years we've been receiving the Strategic Partnerships Grant. Given the complete withdrawal of our federal funding, the state funding we get and the council funding is absolutely critical to maintaining our city program. It simply wouldn't exist without that support.